Okay, in this problem, we're given a continuously differentiable function f of x1, x2, x3, x4 is equal to x1 times x4 minus x2 times x3. And we're given a point p at 1, 2, negative 1, negative 2. And we want to show that first the gradient vector of f at p doesn't equal 0. And then we want to find an equation for the tangent set to the level set where f is equal to f of p at the point p. Okay, so first let's show that the gradient vector of f at p does not equal 0. So we can calculate the gradient vector. is the partial derivative of f with respect to x1 as our first component, which is x4. Partial derivative with respect to x2, negative x3, negative x2, and x1. So we get the following gradient vector, and we want to calculate it at the point p. So we'll just plug in our values for p, so we get And we get the vector negative 2, 1, negative 2, 1, which doesn't equal the 0 vector. So that's showing that the gradient vector of f at p does not equal 0. Now we want to find an equation for the tangent set to the level set uh, where f of p, or where f is equal to f of p. So first, let's calculate f of p. plug in our point P into our equation for F, we get x1 times x2 is negative 2 minus x2 times x3, which is negative 2. So we're looking at the level set where F is equal to 0. So, and we want to find a tangent set which is the gradient vector of f at p dotted with x minus p equals 0. So we have the gradient vector of f at p. So we can plug that in. We have x1 minus 1, x2 minus 2, x3 plus 1, and x4 plus 2, and that equals 0. So we can calculate the dot product. We get negative 2. And we get the equation of our tangent set is negative 2 times the quantity x1 minus 1 plus x2, the quantity x2 minus 2, and then minus 2 times the quantity x3 plus 1 and plus x4 plus 2 equals 0. So that's our equation for the tangent set to the level set at f of p, at p.